on. My microphone wasn't on. There we go. Why was the picnic odd? Mitchell, you're going to open up to page five, sweetheart, okay? Prince, why was it odd? Because what? What did the kids do with all their picnic things? They ate them before they even got to the picnic. But then Oswald had a surprise. What was the surprise, Jaden? Gumdrops. Gumdrops. So then this is also odd. At the picnic, they just ate candy. So two odd things. The kids ate all their picnic foods on the way to the picnic, so then they had nothing to eat at the picnic. But Oswald had hid gumdrops. So then they could eat candy for a picnic. Is that what you eat for a picnic? Yeah. No. My sweets, what you're going to do is you're going to listen, and he's going to tell you top or bottom. You have to look at your page. Don't look up here at me. Look at your page so that when he sentence or what picture to look at, you know what he's talking about. JR, I need you to put that away so you're ready to look at your book. Here we go. Look at page five. Find the title of the story. Circle the word odd. Where do we find the title? The title is the name of the story. Where do we find that on this page? Tamia. Nope, this is not the title. This is the top of that first page. The first sentence. Where do we find the title? What's the title? Jair, you need to not talk to her. You should not be looking at her and mouthing things either, sweetheart. You need to be focusing and paying attention. Where do we find the title, Mason? On this crooked line. It said that we need to find which word. Do you remember? What word did it say we needed to find in the title? We needed to find the word what, Addie? Odd. odd. Which one of those words says odd in the title? The first, the second, or the third? Which one says odd? Tamia, the one in the middle. It said to circle the word odd. Circle O-D-D. -D. That is the word odd. Circle odd. O-D-D. -D. Circle odd. Nice ear. Circle the word odd. You need box. My loves, he's going to tell you to turn to the next page. So turn to page six. Mitchell, honey, and Karina, it's good to see you both on. You're looking over here with Etta, Betta, and Cass, and Hot Rod and Elf. Listen carefully. You need to follow along, sweetheart. I will help you later, but not right now. I told you to take out your pencil boxes a long time ago, sweetheart, so this is a natural consequence of you not listening. Turn to page six. Look at the, the bottom of page six. Which super kid thinks they should eat the plums? Mark an X on the picture of the super kid who thinks they should eat the plums. The odd picnic. Now look at the. Sorry, I pushed the wrong thing and then two people started talking. <laughs> Okay, look at the bottom it said. We accidentally skipped this page. We did hear it yesterday, but we didn't read it. It says to put an X on the person who thinks they should eat the plums. Who at the bottom says they should eat the plums? London. Who had the idea to eat the plums? Who had the idea to eat the plums? Jaden. 
Alf did. So you need to make an X on Alf. My loves make an X on Alf. You got you put too much glue on the other day, babe. All right, you need to circle the word odd, sweetie, and then we'll tape that later. Okay. Sorry, Mitchell and Karina, I had to help somebody. Bellies. The bellies. Now we can't all those plums, so how about we just eat them? <laughs> well, that works, but then you have no plums for the picnic. All right, my loves, if you have a copy book like this, I need you to turn to the next page. If you have a book like me, just look at page seven. If you have one of these books, you need to turn to the next page. Turn to page seven. You need to turn to page seven. You guys need to bring your books back from home. All right, my sweets, listen again. He's going to tell you top or bottom. Look carefully on page seven. Or maybe not. Doesn't want to play. Play. On box on page seven. Find the word plug and underline it. You guys couldn't hear him. I'll say it again. It says to find the bottom picture on page seven. So you're looking at the bottom picture. It said to find the word lug. Underline it. Samir already did. Where did you find the lug, Samir? Where's the word lug that you underlined? What word says lug, Samir? So Sal is saying, I cannot lug, L-U-G. What does lug mean again? I cannot lug. What does lug mean? Jaden, he can't carry it. My loves, you need to underline the word lug in his speech bubble, L-U-G. You're not paying attention. L-U-G. G, underline the word lug. He cannot lug the big melon right here, sweetheart. My sweets, please turn to page eight. He'll tell you to do that, but then you're... Now turn to page eight. Look at the top picture on page eight. Mark an X where Lily wants to put the carrot. Oh, cool. All right, so we need to look at the top of page eight. Where does Lily say she wants to put the carrot? Adelia. On the stump. Why does she want to put it on the stump, babe? So the rabbit can go get it. My loves, you need to put an X on the stump. On page eight, put an X on the stump. She wants to put the carrot up there. If you have one of these copy books, you need to turn to page nine. If you have the normal book like me, just look at page nine, okay?
Now, look at the top two sentences on page nine. Find the sentence that says, but the picnic is a problem. Underline the word problem. Okay, he said look at the top two sentences on page nine. But the picnic is a problem. Which sentence says that? You're looking at these top two. Is that the top one or the second one? Which one says, but the picnic is a problem? Jaden, is that the first sentence or the second sentence? The second one. My love, sound it out with me. We need to draw a line under the word problem. So let's read it so we can find that word. Read that second sentence with me, just like Jaden sa said, where it starts with go. You're touching right under the B, up at the top. Good. Here we go. Sound it out with me. Ready? Set. Go. B. But. But. The picnic, keep reading, you need to underline that last word, problem. So take your pencil, draw a line under that last word, problem. My love, you need to turn to page 10. Oh. Do the directions. Now, turn to page 10. Look at the top picture on page 10. Underline the sentence that says, I hid gumdrops. Hmm. Underline the whole sentence. You're looking at the top. Which sentence says, I hid gumdrops? There's two sentences up here that Oswald is saying. Which one says, I hid gumdrops? Which one, Prince? He's saying the second one, this bottom one. My loves, take your fingers, go whoop. Touch under the word I. Let's see if Prince is right. Does that say I hid gumdrops? Sound it out with me. Ready, set, go. I hid. That's the big word. We're up part of it. Let me G U M. Go. G. Um, gum. Now read that last part. D, er, ops, drops. I hid. If Prince was right, say, uh huh. My loves, you need to underline that whole sentence. So that whole thing you just read, I hid gum drops. You need to draw a line under the whole sentence. He did. He hid those gum drops. Thank you, Mr. Porter. All right, my loves, we just have this page, then we're all done. You just completed our learning target. You answered questions about the story, the odd picnic, so we're gonna, but we have a little bit more questions to answer. My loves, I need you to look at the top. <laughs> you see, oh, all the super kids' faces, do they look very happy? No. No, they're kind of like, oh. Let's read what Doc and Sal are saying. So look here at the top in their speech bubble. Read it with me. Ready? So, I d -id did it. It. I did it. Ooh. Oh. I did it. What? Did they eat? The ones who have a copy book need one of those. What did, hold on, sweetheart. What did they eat? 
They're telling Elf. If you don't know, look back in the story. What did Doc and Sal eat? If you don't know, look back at the story. Which one of these things did they eat? What was it, Jaden? If you don't know, look back at the story. What did Doc and Sal eat? They ate the melon. My loves, what you're going to do is you're going to draw a line from Doc and Sal right over to the melon. They did that. They ate the melon before they got to the picnic. So draw a line to the melon. Draw a line from Doc and Sal to the melon. Now let's go down. We're gonna go down the side on the left and then we'll do the right side. Now look at Cass and Edabetta. Read what they're saying in their speech bubble with me. Ready, set, go. I did it. Oh no, at least they're being honest. They're not lying. They're saying, yeah, I did it. <laughs> what did they eat? If you don't know, go back and look in the story. What did they? Raise your hand. What did they eat? Tamia. They ate the buns. Remember they saw the robin that needed to feed her babies? And so they gave, they left out those bits. They ate the buns. So my loves, draw a line from Cass and Annabetta up to the bun. They did that. They ate it. Draw a line from Cass and Annabetta to the bun. No, you need to do this with us. You didn't do Doc and Sal, and you need to do Etta, Betta, and Cass. Caleb, look here. Look what we're doing, honey. Oh, my. Look down at Elf and Hot Rod. And their speech bubble. Ready? 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 Set. Go. I did it. What did they eat? Raise your hand. What did Elf and Hot Rod eat? They ate the, not the carrots. What did they eat? Crints. If you don't know, look back in the story. What did they eat? Find, find Elf and Hot Rod. Find their page. What did they eat? What did they eat, sweetie? The plums. Yeah, Elf put the plums in us yeah. oh the plums are way up at the top you guys so you got to draw a really long line from elf and hot rod up 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 to the plums draw a really long line from elf and hot rod up to the plums you guys are doing great did you know that when you look back at the story you're acting like a big kid because when you get to be in middle school, if you don't know the answer to a question and you were reading a book with your story, I need you to get that out. Even if you're done, I need you to follow along with us and double check. So what you guys are doing is acting like big kids. You guys are doing great. You're going back to look in the story. I love that. Oh boy, tick tack and talk. 5K, what are they saying? They're saying, I did it. What did they do? What did they end up doing? Do not play with your pencil. You need to listen and follow along, sweetheart. What did they do? They drank all the lemon pop. They did not share any of it. They each drank like two because they had all those cans laying there. Oh, draw a line from Tic Tac and Tac to the lemon pop. You got it, London. Thanks, Mason, for the thumbs up. Thanks, Prince. Lily and Nikki, what are they saying, 5K in their speech bubble? They're saying, I did it. What did Lily and Icky do? Raise your hand. What did Lily and Icky do? <sighs> Jaden. They ate all the carrots, but they shared one. Yeah, they shared one with the rabbit. They did. They shared one with the rabbit. Good job. My sweet strong line from Lily and Nikki to the carrots. You got it.
<laughs> and now look down here at the bottom. It says the super kids. And they're, they're all saying, I did it. What did all of the super kids get to eat at the picnic? They got to eat the? Gumdrops. The gumdrops. So draw a line from all the super kids up to the gumdrops. Awesome. Boys and girls. Who can raise their hand and tell me what our learning target was today? What were we doing? Bridget, we were answering about the, about the, we were answering the questions about the story. You got it, my loves. You can very quietly put your reading books away. And if you have your math test heading to do, you can do that. Mitchell and Karina, you've been marked present for school, my sweets. We'll see you back at 10.50 in a little over an hour for a story. Bye, my loves. Thanks for working hard with us. Okay, did you finish your